Just got a awesome prize today, <laughs> our delivery. Uh, it just came, and many of you can tell by the shape of the box what this is. Um, I ordered mine the last part of May, I believe it was. And the box is in good shape, so... Looks like everything else is in good shape in here. Hmm. It's okay. You would uh, think there'd be an anti-static bag around this bad boy, but I guess not. But anyway, there we go. Ultimate 64. Can't wait to uh, mess around with it. Uh, most people I've seen, they put them in a, a new case, a 64C style case or, or something like that. But I've got a, a different idea for this bad boy. I have a 128 that I cut down to make <laughs> so I could use it just as a keyboard for a 128D. Um, I'm going to hook this thing up in here. And it should fit. This cable's in the way. But I think it should fit in here okay. Yeah, it's going to fit in there perfectly. Everything will fit in there nice. Uh, I gotta come up with a back for it here. I'll 3D print out something to seal this all in, make some mounts in here. So I'll have uh, a pretty neat looking uh, 128 keyboard. Um, if you watch my other videos, I had already figured out how to make the, the number pad work and the function keys and uh, some of the directional keys. So when I hook this up, I should have a you know pretty much fully functional um, keyboard. Um, this is this won't be on there, of course. This is just what I rigged up to work with the 128D. But yeah, that'll make it nice and compact, something different, because I really like the 128 keyboard better than any other one. Uh, I kept the power adapter in there. I'm glad I did, or the power LED. That way I can just hook it right up. Uh, maybe I can rig up some type of uh, mod with it to make it cooler. You know, maybe two different colors when there's some uh, hard drive activity or something. Um, I haven't watched. Uh, I haven't watched a single video on these uh, Ultimate 64s, um, so I don't know anything about them. I don't know how to set them up. Anything. So I'll mess around and, and get all that done. I do plan on uh, doing quite a few uh, cool things with this uh, since there's no user port and the uh, Wi-Fi adapter I know is not set up yet. I'm going to uh, build a special version of my Wi-Fi modem to plug on here so it'll be internal. Uh, see how that goes. Um, maybe come up with a... Uh, internal uh, Pi 1541 uh, there's plenty of room in here where that could be put it should fit fit underneath there good I would think so you know there's some some ideas uh, maybe maybe not I'm not sure what all will work out what won't we'll just have to see how it goes but uh, so it'll be something fun something new something different but uh Hopefully I'll have another video with, uh, you know, putting it in here and setting it up.